Okay, I was thinking I could get past this barrier at some point, but it appears not. All right, ambush me. An alluring skull. All of that for an alluring skull. I guess the path continues over this way, though. Whoa! I did not actually think you were a cage that would attack me. All these people just up. Oh, pupper. And I saw a second pupper over here. All right, second pupper. Chest, huh? Ambushes! I heard the screaming and I knew what was coming. Although I didn't know it was going to be cages. Such an odd enemy. All right, what's in the chest? Human pine resin? Human pie res pine resin. What does that even mean? Gold pine gives you lightning. Human is dark. Uh, I guess... Tell me how you really feel about humanity. <laughs> oh, that is a ghost. Are these dead? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Two of the ladies? Do you want me to kill two of them? Oh, no. Hopefully, if I come down here... No! Okay, I only got staggered. I didn't actually take damage! This sucks. Why are there two of you? Why do you have so much reach? Are you coming down here? This, this, this sucks. <laughs> All right. I'm going to Homeward Bone to the Shrine Bonfire. I think it's time to take a quick second. I have 20,000 souls. I don't want to lose them. I feel like fighting these ladies is going to be dangerous. Welcome home, speak that. All right, I had an item for you. Ashen one. To be sovereign, I'll fashion one. Very well, then take Nara. Or do I have to give the item to the other lady? Okay, uh... I have to level up quite a bit just to get a single attunement slot. Four times to get a single attunement slot. But having a healing spell at my disposal would be useful. So I can do that. Vigor, endurance. We'll go with that. Farewell, may the All right. Uh. Oh, how give umbral ash. Give morticians ashes. Let this ash I only hope these are. Okay, so she has new items for sale now that I've given that to her. A second key, grave key. Key to a door in the undent sediment sewer. Oh, okay, I know where that door is. I don't know what the dried finger does. Do I need some kind of a, some kind of a, kind of a catalyst for my, uh,
for my spells. Oh, can I equip my covenant here? Ah, uh, warrior of sunlight. But I currently don't have a a spell casting thing of any kind. Where do I equip my spells? I think I, oh, I think I do it at a bonfire. Uh, reinforce Estus. Infuse weapon. What does infusing do? Okay, I can turn it into a refined, a raw, or a fire one. Okay. So that's how I, like, transform the weapon, and then just increasing it is here. And it requires Titanite shards to do that. Okay. Makes sense. Tune spell. Cool. Slightly restore HP. Burn undead bone shard. This will make it so my Estus will heal me more. Okay. Now I do need a catalyst of some type, it looks like, to cast a spell. But I don't have the faith level required for it. My intelligence is eight and my faith level is nine. So I need one more level to uh, be able to use a talisman. It was attunement that I would level it, I was leveling up to uh, get another spell. So now I need to level up. I need to eat some souls. Inventory. I don't think that's enough. I meant to do three. I still don't think that's enough. There we go. That should be plenty. Alright, with faith up to level 10. I can now equip the talisman in my other hand. And while that is active, I can heal myself. Cool. All right, so now I want to go back because I got to deal with the two ladies. I've got the two ladies to deal with, I have the tree to deal with, and then I have the road of sacrifices to explore. Alright, so when I am two-handing my sword, I cannot cast my healing spell, so if I want to heal, I have to, to, to pull out the catalyst and then cast a spell. And I only have uh, so much FP for healing. 
Jeez. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, but that why why did I see things down in that gorge? I'm going to have to explore that closer. Oh, I have a key to the sewer too. Crap. <laughs> I have a lot to do. All right, first we wait for the lady and her entourage to to hurry it up and get out of the way. My souls. Now we're gonna make a break for it. Everybody wants me to die. <laughs> I'm hoping the big angry fire demon doesn't respawn. I get the feeling he won't, but I could be wrong. Was I looking the wrong? I was looking at the wrong side. I didn't realize that there was a that it made a difference. <laughs> I was waiting for my chance to roll off. It's only on that side. <laughs> it's fine. I was like, I don't want to miss it. But where is it? I still took damage. It's fine. Big angry fire demon. Yay, nay. It's looking like a nay. Well, that's good, at least. Still have to worry about the big two angry ladies that want to slap me around. Alright, so that cage is alive. No, oh my god. Let me just roll right off. Oh, wow. I heal so much more. Wait a second. Why is that such a significant increase? Did that dog just fall off. All right. Are the cages going to drop if I don't go near the chest? Don't mind me. I'm just dumb. What does it say? Try luring it out. So to speak, try ranged battle. Nope, I also aggroed the cages. Throwing stuff at me. Okay. Got one lady down. I just got to take out this cage. And now <clears throat> for the other one. I don't like how much she delays that swing. Ow. Oh, oh. 
see ya. Definitely would not want to be ya. Why is it that everybody in this game that's, like, chunky is scary? <laughs> I guess except for the rat. The rat wasn't, uh, really a big threat. There should still be a dog down there alive somewhere, I think. So what is up this way? What What is worth all of the hassle? We can drop down there and get into that tower. There's an item up here. Oh, there's the dog. Flynn's ring. What does that do? Lowering equipment load increases attack. Odd? Oh, wait, it, does this decrease my total equipment load? Is that what it's doing? Or is the ring heavier? The ring is heavier and I'm so close to the cusp. Yeah, no, that's that's what's happening. <laughs> I'm I'm at sixty nine point six percent and I think seventy percent is the threshold for fat rolling. I don't think I want to let myself fat roll. Am I above the church? Where the tree is? Another homeward bone. This is scary. This is sketch. I, I survived. <laughs> Mira outfit. Gives me less protection, but it's lighter. I don't know. The, the stuff I'm wearing is all pretty good for... I'm mostly looking at physical defense. Chlorinthy ring. What does that one do? Re raises stamina recovery speed. Oh, that's nice. I can wear that without fat rolling. I don't like hearing her 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 staff clinking and clanging out there. It's intimidating. Somebody just fell to their death. Uh, where do I go now? Do I have to just jump off here? I guess there is a way down there. I'm more concerned about the dog. All right, lady, I've already killed two of you. Ah! All right. I do not consent to any kind of a hug.
Alrighty then. That's horrifying. Alright, it's just a shirt. So I guess there is... Oh, is that another dog? So... Down this way. Is there an, a way into the gully down here? Well... Is that the sewer, actually? That might be the sewer. Ignore the fact that I just, like, glitched <laughs> uh, to death. Hey there. I hope you're enjoying the videos of the Dark Souls 3 adventure with me and my best friend. I'd love to hear what you all think, so please leave a like or a comment and consider subscribing to follow my journey to beat as many games as I can. Thank you for taking the time to watch, and I'll see you in the next one.